weekly update for May 6th, 2016. And uh, this is going to be a relatively short weekly update uh, because most of uh, this week was taken up with uh, proofreading, Jeff Seiler's proofreading on reads. And as you can see, as a Word document, it printed out to, uh, well, by Jeff's count, 143 pages, and by my count, 148 pages. And as you can see, when I found a correction that needed to be made, uh, I would just bend down the corner of the page there and write uh, the page number and a question mark, because uh, I'm not really sure if we were, we were using the same page numbering. Uh, but uh, page five, question mark, and as you can see, quotation marks missing at the beginning of that line. I can't believe that Jeff would have missed that, so that's one of those computer mysteries that we are definitely getting used to in our day-to-day -day life. Uh, a correction that goes in doesn't necessarily stay in. you got to keep putting it in and putting it in until the computer finally gives up and does it your way. And that was followed by a fax from uh, Tim W. at uh, a moment of service that came through with uh, a printout of uh, Jeff Seiler's Reading Reads. Uh, everything is, uh, is content in this day and age. So uh, you can look forward to that coming up on a moment of Cerebus uh, tomorrow, uh, May 7th, as part of uh, Jeff Seiler's regular posting. Reading Reads, uh, his first experience with uh, trying to um, proofread on, uh, on a computer-generated printout of uh, a massive uh, text volume like Reads. And now it's over to Sean Robinson, and this fax came in from him, which is uh, him creating new pages in digital form, imitating as closely as possible what the Reed's text pieces look like. And he's done a phenomenal job importing scans of the original majuscules, the uh, oversized letters that started the text pieces, uh, imitating the typeface, and uh, imitating the winding. So um, a lot of pages and a lot of work, but that's being worked on right now. And apart from that, uh, the Great Cerebus Giveaway, Free Cerebus, uncirculated copies of Cerebus that were stored at Record Distribution in Leamington from uh, the time of their publication until November of 2015, are continuing to be made available from uh, Wes Hagen's comic book Warehouse of Wonders. 3310 King Street East at River Road here in Kitchener. So as you can see, we got uh, Cerebus Bi-Weekly number one, Cerebus Bi-Weekly number two, and Cerebus Bi-Weekly number three. Don't know how many of those uh, Wes has got left. Uh, the only way to find out is uh, to head on over there, 3310 King Street at River Road here in Kitchener. And just walk in the front door and uh, the first staff person you see say, I am here for my free Cerebus comics. Bagged and boarded with uh, the Certificate of Authenticity and a Cerebus archive first release gold seal. And there we go, uh, weekly update for May 6th. And uh, like I said, it's going to be, it was a short one this week. 
Uh, we'll see if we can uh, have more news and information for you next week for the update on May 13th. And God willing, we'll see a bunch of you then. Have a good week.